What up, world? It's your boy Jay Winks. You now in tune into the Winks Steel channel. Yes, on this cold Saturday afternoon. Yes, it is cold outside. So I hope y'all inside, chilling. Super Bowl weekend. I'm going with Kansas City. Who you got, babe? Kansas City, because I like their uniforms. I don't even know what to say. Yeah, but we're going with Kansas City in this house. Or Brady might be a GOAT. She don't like Brady at all. But going on with the show, thank you for subscribing, liking, share my channel. Thank you. Uh, I have a UK uh, subscriber now. So shout out to Leon. That's his name. Twitter. Follow me on Twitter and everything like that. So shout out. First UK fan. So thank you. We're going on with today. I hope y'all, like I said, cold day. Crazy Royal Rumble last uh, Sunday. I watched it. It watched me a little bit, but I watched it. That's how it goes. When you got to wake up too early in the morning. And this week was horrible. I mean, they didn't do no streets when the snow was hitting and everything like that. So. Uh, I'm not going to complain. Edge won. Bianca Blair won. I was surprised. No new people showed up. So, mm. we'll see going on to WrestleMania season. New music. Now, I'm going to split it up. There was a lot that came out. And a lot I, not, I did not know came out. Like, Wiz Khalifa came out with one at the end of the year. A lot of artists, so I'm um, gonna shout out maybe six of them new releases that just came out. First one I want to talk about it came out yesterday. Yesterday, Conway the Machine and Ghost LTD dropped a, a project, it's on Bandcamp right now. It's not on Spotify, Apple Music, or anything right now. So, if you have Bandcamp, that's the way you can buy the album for $12. And it's uh, free streaming right now. But you can, like like I said, Bandcamp is on a whole total total different game. Different artists. You can look up different genres and everything like that. But the album is called If It Bleeds, It Can Be Killed. I heard it yesterday. Woo. I ain't going to sound out no of these songs, but I'm just going to say these artists that just... Draw some. Next up, Feral Mont. Yes. If you don't remember him, he dropped the song early 2000s, around like 99, 98. Uh, Simon Says. Been doing a lot of great work right now. Like I said, a lot of these older artists that, that people are like, oh, I don't listen to them no more. Go check their music out because it's just different. He dropped the album Magnificent Scent. Day for Exorcism. Kind of crazy album title, but you know. The weekend dropped highlights. I haven't listened to it yet, so I just know it popped up on my Spotify. Uh Devin the Dude. Yes. Devin the Dude. If you never listened to Devin Dude album, the great albums. Uh he dropped Soulful Distance. Uh, God Fahim and your old dude Drew did a collaboration album called The Wolf on Wall Street. So go listen to that. Just want to plug in, uh, some people. Uh, Mystery's got a, a new merch coming out for Valentine's. Go look it out. The pink hoodie's hot. Uh, my boy Young Cats has got his merch out. I got my merch out. Thank you for everybody who's been buying my merch. I appreciate it. So we're going to get into... I got my notes right. A couple artists I just started listening to recently. I mean, like Thursday. I was off work, sitting at home, just chilling, cleaning, and just stumbled upon these artists. Oh, yes. Great Lakes today. I switched it up. 
What a, this is a rapper I listened to on Thursday. His name is Six Letter. He's a rapper based out of Toronto, Canada. Uh, he dropped the album called FNL. I just want to shout out three songs. Episode. I don't know what I wrote on that one. And Space Speech. Not for sure with the second song. I couldn't read my writing line at the moment. Next up, another artist I listened to. He started following me. I woke up Thursday morning like I usually do. Like I'm going to work. So it was kids asleep. Got them ready to go to school and everything like that. Put on my headphones, started cleaning. That boy Vic. He's a down south artist. Like I said, I found him Thursday, retweeted his music, started following me on it. He dropped an album called The Almighty Pen. This is a really dope album. I really like it. Uh, I think I might put the picture up on my story or something like that. It's Mouth Max and everything like that. A dope album. Uh, when the Greatest Ones Return, featuring a Ransom and Raz Fresco, another artist out of Canada. I found out Thursday. So I've been doing my homework, just listening to different artists. I'm going to make another uh, Spotify playlist, so watch out for that. Uh, Fatal Affairs, Game 5, Brian and Irving, a throwback album. I just want to put out there, uh, Cameron's birthday was uh, this week, so I was listening to Purple Haze. Man, I, I I just remember listening to this album. Uh, I've been listening to Cameron since 98, when he dropped Horton's Carriage off of Confessions of the Fire. Yeah. I'm a big Cam fan. Three songs I want to shout out. More Gangster Music, featuring Joel Santana. Hey, I was listening to that last night. Hey, hey, here we go. Dipset. I wish I had that Dipset vinyl. Man. I will look for that, and when I get it, all my Dipset fans, I'm going to do a Dipset and a G-Unit. Yes, I just want to do the first Dipset album and the first G-Unit album. I think that'd be, whoo, that's what we used to listen to. Um, Adrenaline and Rush, the remix, featuring Twista. Cam went off on that, really did. Uh, get On Girls. Like I said, I'm a big Cam fan. So, going on, we got Vinyl Talk. Like I said, we slimmed it down on the three albums. Next week, I think I might do Kanye West. I got two of his albums and most of them. I'm not for sure. I've been really thinking about just changing it up. My wife just got a new album. What's the new album called? <clears throat> it's new to me, but it's not a new album. It's Whoa. called Manassas. The band Manassas. Manassas. Stephen Stills Band. One of Stephen Stills' bands. I don't know if it's on Spotify or not. But going on with the show today. Well, like I said, I was divided about which albums I'm going to do, but I'm not for sure if I did this one before or I just showed it on Facebook. I'm not for sure. Or I might have been doing it on uh, my Facebook Live and I might have showed it. So, whatever. LL Cool J's Radio. This album came out in November 1985. Little side story. Always got a side story sometimes for it. So, I was in eighth grade. And if you went to the Edgewood with me, remember the janitor named Wayne. Black guy. Uh, so I, me and my stepmom, shout out to my stepmom, Pam, have been writing radio. I can't believe my radio. Writing the lyrics and everything. That's the song I was going to do. I'll do a side note when I get to Buster Rhymes. But that's going to be funny. But so... I didn't know that Wayne knew how to play keyboard. We talked about it. So he does the keyboard for me just doing the lyrics of the song. We killed it, but we still lost. 
the twin sisters doing the dance. But hey, it is what it is. We did it for three weeks, like practice. I was doing the track at that time too. So I would get done with track, go shower, go upstairs in the gym and practice with him because he's cleaning the gymnasium at that time. So that was the only time we had together. I wonder where he is too. I like it. Say thank you. But going on, uh, like I said, killed it. Uh, Rock the Bells was on there. And Dangerous. A great album. Great hip-hop album. I think LL is the first artist to release an album on Def Jam. I'm pretty, pretty sure. 98%. If I'm wrong, call me out on it on Facebook, Instagram, or Twitter. Next up, it's a, a a a group that I personally like. A lot of people probably don't know. I'm into the boom bap rap. Try Call Quest, Low Theory, Low End Theory. Sorry about that. My uncle Ron used to play this all the time. So these two albums, I got two Try Call Quest albums. Man, I mean this is a classic hip hop album. I mean like we can start from Extra Susan, all the down to the scenario. No, I know everybody knows scenario, the remix, everybody. Oh, no, no. I love that. But there's other cuts on there, you know what I'm saying? Uh, my other two songs, a verse from Ashtrack, you know, how to put scenario on there and uh, bugging out. Next up. I love this album cover. A lot of artists on here. Uh, there's two short right here. Kumo D, RP Heavy D, uh, Beastie Boys right here. Uh, Dougie Fresh. You got Buster Rhymes over here. MC Light, uh, Ice T, uh, De La So. Great. Artists on here on the back. There's more artists on the back. Uh, a young Diddy. I haven't looked at this cover in a while, so I'm not going to try to name everybody off the top of my head. But yes, a great album. You see it. I'm going to try and bridge this in. So you remember NBA Streets Award Show? Started it off when you did it. Doom, doom, doom. I wish I could play music on here. Side note. So, no, wait. I'm going to just go on and finish this. It's a great song. It was on NBA Streets. Uh, shout out to my uncle again. He played this album crazy. Come over, sitting in the backyard. That's when CD players were rare and stuff like that. You know, you had to have a book, you know, it skip on a beat. Like, you go like this and do, 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 do. am I right or wrong, babe? You're right. Yeah. Uh, Eight Million Stories and Oh My God. Oh, oh, uh, oh my God. Bus Ryan's killed it on the uh, chorus on there. Well, like I said, uh, Short video today because I'm slimming it down. I want to talk about something real quick before we get uh in the show. Uh, I did an interview that I put up, I think Monday or Tuesday, Tuesday afternoon, and I had to take it down. I will be putting that video up, but I will be starting a Wink Still channel on Facebook so you can get exclusive videos before I do my videos on YouTube. So I can get more content out. So you'll see a food channel, Teresa Vinyls. She'll be doing some because she's got a lot. She's got a lot to talk about, don't you? I always have everything yeah, she, to say. Yeah. <laughs> but it's your boy, Jay Winks. You're now in tune into the Winks Still channel. Go subscribe, go like, share. Like I said, notification bell. And I'm out. Hope y'all have a good Saturday. Hope Kansas City wins. I'm out. Ow.